Can I get him? No. Oh. Can I hit him? Okay, you got him. <laughs> what the fuck? I was also shooting at him. I, 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 I would have had. Yo. Yo. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> Do you want me to shoot you in the head? Uh, Sorry. How are you doing? Uh, pretty good. Uh, I didn't bring your flare back in, did I? Because I'm a moron. Okay. Oh. Well, you got we got killed, so. Yeah. But we don't have. Okay. Well, well, well we're doing it without a flare then. Um. Let's be positive. You know what I'm excited about? <laughs> Okay, that's the thing I expected you to say the least, but please enlighten me. Henry Cavill doing Warhammer 40k. True, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that man. Uh, I think it's gonna be I pretty mean, good. I mean, he seems to be uh, seems to be pretty nerdy and stuff like that. So you know, he, he is very maybe nerdy. sufficient attention to detail. I'm not saying every nerd should be you know in a position to direct a movie or anything, but you know. I was sad about him quitting The Witcher, but like, I kind of understand why. Yeah, yeah. And he's like so that positive. Choked, like speaking of being positive, positive, right? Yeah. Like all the fucking communication he puts out, I I think yeah. he either yeah. is like a very well balanced, benevolent human being, or he's got like a super duper good PR department. He's got a team, man. Because just, come on, dude. Like, every message he puts out, it's like, well, you know, that sometimes that's just the way she goes. He's like the deadly slop fucking <laughs> attitude, but <laughs> with a bigger smile. You know, what, you know what I mean? Okay, I'm not Superman anymore. That's the way it goes. Yeah, yeah, I gotta Maybe pass on the cape and, and, and shit like that, right? He says, like, the most, like, positive things. Like, hey, I just got fired from my biggest franchise job I, in the fucking I'd, world. Uh, I'm happy for the next guy, you know? Yeah. Like, what? I, I'd be like, I'd be like, you know, you know how I, like... Was in the movie that kind of created the DCU, and you know how the DCU is kind of shit compared to Marvel, yeah. and how I'm the only good thing in the DCU. Well, they decided to get rid of me. Yeah. You you would just be putting out tweets like, "You you all can suck my dick." Tanks DC <laughs> account or whatever, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I'd just be memes. It'd be Becky Lynch memes, you know, Becky Lynch slapping slapping some other chick in the face. What? It'll just be that. Is that a wrestling reference? I don't understand. You're obviously not f not paying attention to my Twitter account. <laughs> I do this a lot. <laughs> you know, do you know who Becky? Do you know who Becky Lynch is? No. Okay. So is Becky that, Lynch is, is that the redhead wrestler you tweeted about? Yeah, so she's far. like I a WWE. Uh, she used to be champion for quite a long time. She's like um, redhead. She used to have this uh, um, steampunk thing going on. Okay. And then uh, her slogan just became... You know, because um, Ric Flair's slogan was the man. Right. Right? Oh. He's the man. Okay. Right? She just stole it from him. I think it, it, it was because like she was so in a rivalry with Ric, Ric Flair's man? daughter. No, she's the man. She has like her... So like for a long time, like lots... She, like her merchandise, the shirt, which would be a black shirt that said in white, said the man. Okay. <laughs> I loved that. <laughs> that was really cool. <laughs> Confusing. Oh, she's the man. She's she's the man. So there are gunshots. Yeah, I heard that. Okay, next time, right? Uh -huh. This time, I'm just gonna shoot. And if it's you, I don't want to hear any complaints. All right. Dude, what the fuck? He wore a different <laughs> color helmet. Dude, you didn't follow my advice. I, well, I didn't really. I just dropped the hint. It's just your your sequential perception of what happens, and if I actually got up and run around, it's like, oh, yeah. don't remember that happening. Doesn't mean it didn't happen. Let's let's like, you know, it's like, what the fuck do you compile your Jonathan, reality out of? <laughs> Jonathan, welcome to human beings. Look, uh, I understand that, but this is not you, like you are. I understand you are a uh, posi you have a positonic brain, all right. What? Uh, but you'll you'll have to get used to humans, <laughs> and I'm here to teach you. Look. Also, you didn't follow my advice. You haven't put on the safety armband, right? Yeah. I have put on the safety armband, all right. 
Okay. Um, Look, it's not like you looked at the armband. The last time you used that, that rifle you used in the last raid, you just shot me in the legs 30 times after visibly seeing me jump down there to save you from the fucking scab that was lighting What up. do you mean visibly? I have explained this to you before, okay? So this is how human beings' perceptions work, right? Yeah. Just because we see something doesn't mean okay. our brain recognizes I'm just saying, it. you had opportunities to, to both visually Just and because. auditively. No, 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 listen to me. So I watched the footage, right? Like you can clearly see me go down there visually, input one, right? It's like multiple multiple methods of confirming a, a, a submarine contact or whatever. And then you also had auditive, AKA sonar in the submarine, where I said, I'm going down there. You know, I'm just saying, there's like a lot of things available to you that you refuse to. Proceed. I don't refuse. <laughs> I just like that's, that's how how brains work. Sometimes you know I'm in the I have adrenaline. I'm, I'm flawed. I'm a human being, and I that's this is why in it's war fair. you have to have very clear communication. True, true. I yeah, I'm going around this corner. Oh, I think I heard somebody. You did? Okay. Now I'm going around this corner. I'm going in the first thing. Yeah. That's very clear communication. I'm going in the house. Oh, you're going in the house now. Okay. I'm going, going around. Yes, I don't think there's anybody in here. No. It's good. This house. I'm going. No, this house clear. In the shed. Okay. I'm looking out in the road again. There's a dead scab here. In. There's a dead okay. scab on the floor right here. I'm going across. Okay. Be careful. There's definitely people. I am. I went right across and I'm now going into the house thing on... Door is closed, but that doesn't have to right? mean anything. You're behind me, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm in front of you now. In. Okay. I'm in the shed. Nice. Yeah, this. Are you in the house? No, I'm in the shed outside. That has a toolbox okay. on it. Yeah, I see you. I see, I see, I see, I see. Where the fuck did they go? Just is murderize the scab and move on, or? Not here. Oh, plexiglass. Oh, I hear scab. Yeah, let's wait if somebody shoots that scab. <laughs> Was a scav radar? Just watch the scabs. That, that's what I use for that stupid camping quest, you know, where you need to, like, camp a bazillion places in, uh, in Tarkov and get 15 kills, 12 kills in each, each of them. Uh, I just use the scabs, and as soon as somebody engaged the scabs, scav I would be bag. like, oh, I'm going to put away my milkshake and pay attention, you know? I'm going to go scav fishing. It's like fly fishing, just yeah, yeah. scavs. Scav is bait. Okay, I don't know where the scav is, though. I'm going to go to the front again. Yeah, other side of the road. I would say, let's go out the back. Go okay. through the garden gate. Then pay yeah, attention to the hill. I'm going to go back. Okay. I'm at the garden gate. Where are you? I'm, on the, I'm out, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hmm. There's another dead scav here. What the fuck yeah. Murder. We should investigate. So I would assume somebody is on this hill if they're sniping. But I haven't seen anyone. I haven't heard anything either. Did you move on? Just a little bit. Oh, there I see. Uh, How did they kill them so? Ah, uh, well, we did spawn a while away. Where did they go? Find their scent. Oh, that's the FOB. Okay. I would say let's uh, let's check out. Let's get a scatter. Let's get ever. Well, I mean, you know, they they clearly used a grenade, so that's a call for help, right? They want us to help them. Okay, here's a new rule. Uh, whenever any one of us throws a grenade now, right? Yeah. We'll have to shout out, 
A most holy grenade. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or uh, a gift from the god emperor. <laughs> I love that in Dark Tide when they go on about the holy grenade. That's like a worms reference, isn't it? Uh, isn't that Monty yeah. Python originally, where they have to kill the yeah, killer, probably. killer rabbit or some shit? Where are you? Uh, I'm towards the F F O B, coming up the hill, next to a big rock on the hill. Okay, I've lost completely lost you, lost you, and I don't know where oh, I see the you. FOB You're is. going the right uh, right way. I'm gonna catch up with okay. you. Oh, I'm I'm. Oh, I'm in front of you? Well, you you veered off to the right. Okay. Should I Close go to, to the left? Oh, I see you. Yeah, okay. Wait, I'm gonna... gonna... Okay, yeah, so I, 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 I know more worms than Monty Python. Really. Wow. Okay, that's a... Uh, I mean, I watched all of Monty Python. I, I just don't find it as funny as most people, I think. Um... It's it's a very specific humor. I think for, with me it's like fifty fifty. You know, so, some of the stuff I think is hilarious, and then some of the stuff I'm like fucking it's, British humor. You know, it's, no, I like British humor. It's, I think it's just too silly at times. Like to me, British humor is not necessarily that silly. It's very whimsical. I just like more dark humor. I, some of it is dark humor as well. Yeah, like, but it's. I don't know. It's just not my. Yeah, some of it is just a little ridiculous. Yeah, I see what you mean. I'm more like a dry humor kind. Of like, if I mean, nobody in the English-speaking world listening to this will will know what I'm talking about. But you will. Uh, so I'm more of a Loriot kind of guy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I so can get behind that. That's a German comedian. It's very, very dry. So I don't see anyone in there. I see a chair that I almost mistook for a person. <laughs> I see a chair. I see a light post. Uh, nice. Let's play this game. I see a was was du nicht siehst. Yeah, and What's it's red. English? What's the English name for that? Oh, the blood of a scarf <laughs> that I just shot. I don't see and oh. Well, there's people are shooting at each other, both from our right yeah, and from, from our right. right somewhere. Yeah. Where's the other guy? Not sure if we're like hidden well enough here, but I don't know. I'm gonna try to look towards the right. Yeah, see if they come down the hill there or something like that. So I can spot them. You're pretty well hidden at that tree, at least. Yeah, I kind of need to crouch, otherwise I can't. I, I don't have the right elevation with the scope. Yeah, because you can't lie down because it slopes downward or something. No, I can lie down, but then I can't look up. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, I know. I know the struggle. But I don't see anybody here either. But it's woods. Like, you know. Yeah, they could go down to the water. They could escape me down to the water, but if they run out to Ruev, which by the way is open as an extract, or towards UN, I can get a shot on them. Having a having a bit of pineapple juice, you know. Yeah. <laughs> the, the other guys in the in the sh in the men's shower will appreciate it later. <laughs> wow. Hey, it's wartime. <laughs> what Naturzekt spiel is that a not, wartime not, thing? Oh, I see a guy, but I'm not sure if it's a scav. Where? The scav is moving into the fob now. Okay. Let's I see if he see gets shot. There's, there's like a tree in the way. What happens if I lie down and then I can't see shit? Maybe somebody's still doing capturing outposts and just trying to pe kill people in there. Maybe people don't know that the wipe's on. Yeah, they're just going about their... Maybe they're grinding and still want to get kappa. Oh god, that'd be quite late for kappa. Scaf is moving into the fob still. He's in. 
I mean, I got it on the last three days or whatever. Or five ah, yeah, days yeah. Now I remember. Like. Yes, you had a very close Kappa last wipe. I completely dropped it this time because I have. For me, it's more like, uh, did you get all the hard quests done? I'm like, yeah. Just a couple of items. You, you don't. You don't have Kappa right I now. I don't have Kappa right now. No. I, wow. I, I have stopped caring. We both stopped caring. I cared about the stopped caring about little Kappa. How how the turns table, my friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For me, it's Dark Tide. I, I care too much about the Emperor right now. Uh, yeah, I've been getting uh, back into WoW. It's been very enjoyable. They did a very good expansion. I've been raiding with some randoms, which is always a challenge. But This is amazing enjoyable. because last time you were giving me shit about playing an MMO. Like, <laughs> they're very toxic. You shouldn't play MMOs. Hey, I'm back into WoW, everybody. Well, look, you gotta, you know, it's like, uh, you know, <laughs> sometimes you, a man's got a, a, a monk main tank is gonna do what a monk main tank's gonna do. You know? Are you a monk? I am. Or I am. Are I'm you just multiple. fisting everybody? I am indeed fisting people, yeah. Nice. Nice. So don't hear only only with their consent, I'm guessing. No, no, it's the enemies. They definitely get them. Um, yeah. oh. And he's like a real martial arts guy and stuff like that, right? He can summon like spirit animals and this meditation <laughs> stuff and whatnot. Yeah, that's what they do in the U UFC all the time. You they know, summon an su ox. Oh. That's that's to the back. Uh, pretty far away, though. Yeah. Want to check it out? Nah. Okay. Don't want to run back. That's boring. wow. Okay. I kind of like lying here, you know, talking to you. All right. I mean, that's of course Just very chill, romantic. <laughs> yeah. Drinking your recycled pineapple juice. <laughs> Are you walking? Nope. Oh, I'm. Am I dehydrating? What is going on? Wait. I'm exhausted. Come on, lie down, friend. Lie down. It's yeah, because you. Um, did you bind your key so he holds his breath immediately when you do the thing? I have no. I have no energy. <laughs> Let me just remedy the situation. What the hell did you just eat? It sounded like you just popped a plastic bag or something. Chocolate. Some nice chocolate. Oh my god, I've been... Uh, you know that I, I'm watching Voyager? I think we talked about this before. Right. Uh, yesterday night, it happened. It happened. Scorpion Part 2. Season 4, Episode 1. I, I have no idea what, what's in the, that. The episode. Said seven of nine. Seven of, uh, I was about to say. <laughs> yeah. Man, that episode, that, that's a good episode, like that that two-part episode, like I remember watching that on TV that fucking blew my mind, where like the Borg turn up and then like the Borg cubes explodes, they all explode and you're like, what the fuck, and they meet like this race that is like the Borg are on the run, Right. they're like killing billions of Borg, I remember oh, back yeah, in the day yeah, yeah. when, you know, you know, you were so scared of the Borg and then Voyager they're just like, goes, oh, the, are Borg, the Borgs are... The Borg are nothing. <laughs> just these guys are the real bad guys. It's like a, an expanse situation, right? Where you go like, yeah. Well, so yeah. we we've got this technology thing, uh, and it's made by somebody a lot less terrifying than what uh, made them go extinct. What? Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. What? <laughs> I actually remind me very much of Babylon Five, um, also because you know it uses that was the first real Star Trek episode where they had like a CGI character. Right. Like you know the aliens. Um, so and the ships it just reminded me of babylon 5 which is like you have this like parallel space and then these these really powerful aliens pop out um yeah i, I just enjoy seven seven is amazing very cool character i i, I was uh, I, I think actually like uh that a uh, seven of nine is pro uh, uh, along with data are probably some of the characters that lots of people who are um, struggling with social codes and stuff like that can identify a lot with, you know? Yeah, I mean, she, like, I had, like, 
two things um, surprised me seeing that episode right. again because oh. I hadn't seen it in a while. The first one was how hot There's Seven of Nine is. There's a guy at the FOB. Yeah. At the left side. Oh, sorry, it's just. Yeah, e never mind. Even with um, with Borg makeup, like with the Borg shit, like there's still a very sexy suit. You know, all the other Borgs have just like normal. Yeah, yeah. and she's know, like in the just, skin like, this tight. rubber suit. <laughs> she has like she's like boobs and massive booty in like this Borg suit, and I like mean, even with yeah. all the v all visually, the things. <clears throat> I think the character was mostly made for you know like the the male totally. nerd gaze for and me stuff like that. for me for you i was like exactly. 17 at the 16 17 at the time. um i had i had like a life size poster uh in my room <laughs> <laughs> that's like you know like, normal normal boys that age had like fucking pamela anderson and carmen electra yeah, and shit like that and yeah. you had like fucking seven of nine <laughs> so when, when i had when my when my now my girlfriend now my wife back then not even my girlfriend when right. i was courting my girlfriend and she came in my room the first time i closed the door right and on the back of the door there's a life-size poster of seven of nine in this like tight skin suit leaning right at the bulkhead on the voyager like yeah, she she knew that she knew at that point that it was gonna get weird. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and so so, but the other thing that surprised me is how well Jerry Ryan actually acts. That whole like thing where yeah. they, they pull her out of the collective and yeah. she's like really good at that. So I can't remember that because when I watched that, I mean I've watched it since, but yeah. I kind of like my prevailing memory is when I watched it originally on TV and because I was like sixteen years old or whatever at the time. Yeah, and massively on hormones i didn't notice any of the act yeah it was like Whoa. Uh, yeah. boobs I, I remember that as uh, so we watched it a couple of years ago we watched all of voyager and i remember that uh, i found that incredibly uh interesting because she's obviously very distraught being disconnected from the hive mind right yeah. so it's like losing a family but a thousand times over um yeah i i, I have yeah. that in, in good memory as well actually well, and she's like, um, also not only that, but like because she's grown up, she, you know, she was a kid when she was assimilated. Yeah. She has like this, and they, they have to teach her all of like being human again. Yeah. Which I think it's a really good plot device. Yes. That whoever wrote that was, uh, that was really good. So um, That's a good thing to do. And like, you know, I, I'm sorry. I know they replaced Jennifer Leon with Jerry Ryan because the show was flagging and they needed more boobs on the show. Like Wait, they not replaced somebody Jennifer. for seven of nine? Yeah, Cass. You know, Cass leaves the ship in the oh, next episode. Oh shit! Um, and I didn't yeah, know that was related you, at all. Okay. You well, no, they they replaced her because like the show was not doing uh, the ratings weren't good. They were like, we need some, we need a sexy boy. Ca Cass is the weird the alien up. lady that. Uh, yeah. 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 Okay. And why I like the actress, like the character just was shit. Like well, that's why you don't remember because the character is fucking boring. She doesn't do anything for like two seasons. Like yeah, she's yeah. on screen all the time with the but doctor. But she's he like the lot. crazy empathy, weird mating yeah, ritual kind of. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I remember her. No, I no, didn't she, find yeah, her no, story p particularly interesting. I find the well, it's Borg reintegration storyline much more interesting. It's they could have done something out of it because she's like this uh, race that lives seven years, right? So. She has like yep. this very different. That that's an interesting story, but then they do like psi shit, and she leaves the ship because she transcends into like an energy being, yeah, um, which is like just Deus Ex Machina, get her out of there. <laughs> um, but like, uh, she's just like whoever wrote the character, just they didn't know what to do with her, and she's she has a lot of screen time. She's like with the Doctor all the time. She has a lot of stories, but they're all boring. Right. By the way, the episode before this episode is. Uh, some people being, I think, Tuvok and Paris being on the holodeck. And... It's going down. Okay. Uh, they're on the holodeck and they're, they're, they're caught in this holodeck novel and Janeway has to rewrite it on the fly, right? Yeah. And then she like, writes something and rescues them. And then Tuvok goes, I have to, like, after they're out, I have to congratulate you uh, on, like, writing these aliens in there because, like, to rescue us, that was really well done. And then Janeway looks at him, smiles, and says, who says Deus Ex Machina is, uh, as a literary device is outdated? Uh, <laughs> and then there's, like, a second pause. And it's... That is should, incredibly you know, that, self ironic. Yeah, that is so self ironic. That is just Star Trek writers being <laughs> having a lot a bit of fun there. <laughs> that was great. 
Of course, I never understood that as a kid, but now I'm like, well, this is good. There's nothing happening. No. Shall we go there, into the fob? There's literally a guy that went right in the in the front of the fob. By the way, we need to go to the other side of the map to extract because ha I didn't check okay. our extraction fob. How are you seeing this shit? I just see fog. What kind of scope do you have? Don't you have a six times as well? Yeah, when you zoom in? the scope's not the problem. There's just fog. I mean, you just see oh. some swishing around and stuff like that. You know Wait, what I mean? I'm going to lay, lay down again. I'm, I'm, I'm blacking out. Uh, I am um, again ran food? out of energy. Do you need food? I, I got I some food. sorry. Okay. Let me just eat some sorry. Are you next to me? I'm running. I just ran around in a circle. Okay. Oh my god. Scared the shit out of me. Okay, I'm gonna drink some water as well. I'm next to a rock drinking some water. So, so the scab make it make an angry sound? I got this. No? Uh, whereabouts are you next to the rock, right? I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. on the on the rock. You're like, I'm edging. The, <laughs> I'm doing? edging the rock. I, I'm gonna say, are you fucking the rock? I mean, that's not something I would be ashamed of. He's a good-looking man. Are you rimming the rock? <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a guy running away. There's a scaf um, towards lumber mill now. Anyway, to that costume designer who designed her like suit. suit. Where is he? It's like running oh, yeah. through the field. Uh, wait, wait, wait! I need to get an angle. Nice. Down. There's one more in the fob. That is out. that's some amazing costume design. You know, going from the idea of we need a sexy Borg to that. Also, the doctor has a funny line because he made the suit. He's like, I'm not a fashion guy or something. God. And then he was like, I uh, I also took the liberty of uh, simulating her hair follicles because she has this, you know, luscious right. blonde hair, of course. Uh, and then he's like, as you can imagine, that was a interesting experience for me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, because Robert Ricardo's kind of bald. Ah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Just uh, scaff that, yeah. So somebody's yeah. definitely looted this place, but I'm not sure if it was the scaffs or... Player boys? I'm just looting a scaff right now. Take it all in. It's not, it's not that much, but... Yeah. Fun red saliva? There we go. Well, yeah. Not that I need any. Not that I'm actually doing any quests here. Like, who cares? Why can't I get through here? Oh, you can't get through here. I didn't know that. It's too tight. God uh, damn it. It's too, it's too tight. Uh, that way I can't even go. Okay. Can I loot the guy through the gap? Oh, yeah. Let me have a look here. Can I loot him from here? Oh, I, I can get through here. I'm just an idiot, Johnson. I'm an idiot. What the fuck are you even uh, doing? I'm, I'm. Why does the scav have two shotguns? Oh, it might have been a. I mean, AI scavs do that as well. AI scavs pick stuff up. Do you need some apple juice? Uh, I wouldn't say no to that. Oh, I found a hot rod. Nice. And a grenade. Hmm. Nice. Okay. Uh, Oh, I hear Scav. Yeah. Shoot him. Like, where is he? I don't know. Hello, hello? Hello, hello? Okay, haven't, so far I haven't seen him. I see a laser, that's, I guess that's you. Yeah, maybe he's outside. Or he's in one of the containers. Mm -hmm. No, it's outside, probably. Just outside this container wall. Okay. I'm gonna go around. Don't see him. See the scab I shot though. Is that you? Oh, oh yes. A... What the? I'm, I'm sorry. That was a safety safety shot. I'm sorry. <gasps> ah, I, I was saying I was gonna do that, right? <laughs> unbelievable. Yeah, it's like yeah. okay, sure. It's an accident. They happen. I'm so I'm sorry. Happy little accident. <laughs> all right. Where's the scav? There's a dead scav. There's two dead scavs here. 
behind this thing. Hmm. I don't know where that scan is. Could have gone out the front door, but I also don't know. All right. Mm -hmm. Shall we? Uh, shall we make our way? Yeah. Where are you? What's the extract? I am uh, at the uh, container with the dead bodies. That's the the COVID container. Yeah, I'm here. All right. Okay, there's a lot of dead scavs in here. Would have been great to find a player scav. That's why I voiped because then we could extract. Right yeah. Here. I was I was guessing that. Oh, ten minutes. Where do you have to go? Outskirts? Yeah. But we're light. Okay. It's gonna be fine. Gonna be fine. Oh, voice line to the right. Hmm. Out of breath. Where are you oh going? Yeah. This there is, is. the way to us. Oh, twenty meters ahead. Oh, I see him. I see him. Did I? No, is he running back? Yeah, he, oh, he's looking at me. Did I get him? No. I hit him. Okay, you got him. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. I was also shooting at him. I, 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 I would have had him. you like strafe sideways looking through that side. Yeah. yeah. Why? That's my playstyle. That's not a playstyle unless you're on and like an MPX with a 50 round mag. <laughs> <sighs> I would have gotten him. Like it's I like, actually shot like, him. You know, in that in that. I actually, yeah. I actually shot him, but you just hit him first. But all right. Sorry. Is what like what? He was shooting at me. I was protecting my own life. No, no. I, I'm, I'm not. I, I didn't. <laughs> yeah. I didn't criticize you for killing him. I just, I just said I would have gotten him as it's well. Like in the German, German Austrian comedy movie, where uh, the guy goes like, "Are you criticizing my, uh, my style of writing?" And the guy was like, "That's not a style of writing. That's animal cruelty." <laughs> the only thing I was saying is that my, that my playstyle is valid. I would have yep. gotten him. Yeah, yeah. I was, uh, I was evading the scam. Uh huh. It's the, it's the, it's the, it's, it's the, the fab new meta. Crab. It's the fat meta. It's the fa yeah. fab, fab crap is what we're calling it. You know, you go sideways. Yeah, yeah. So the reason why I avoid walking, unless, unless it's like, you know, when we met the guy at the resort, they used strafe sideways and just unload into the door frame to, to wall bang and stuff like that. Uh, but the reason why I don't do that with uh, scavs and raiders and stuff like that is because it, it makes it incredibly difficult for you to hit anything. Um, and also, they don't care if you move. Like they, maybe they care if they, you full sprint and you don't look at them. But if you move while looking at them, they will still aimbot the shit out of you. Like their aim. But I don't know if it's a you know. human or an AI. I don't. You know. What do you mean? Also, is it's incredibly hard for me to hit the person when I'm still and they're still. So, not like it's making it worse. You know. Shitty ammo. Scav. Somebody looted this. Disappointing. Oh, chocolate. Well, some Yank. somebody went ahead of us, I think. We missed yeah, all the people. The where the fuck is outskirts? Uh, to, the, to your left. Hard left for you. Hard left? Is that like shift left? No, I mean like... Turn left. Oh, there's two scabs know, like running the across the field. The cloud thing. Okay, that. Didn't. Oh, there he is. Okay. Oh, he's down. One of them is down. No, it's one still running. Oh, that was. Uh... I think it's going down to ZP14. Where the fuck is he running? Come on. Is that. Oh, we're, we're, we're running after them. Is that what we're doing? Okay. Sorry, I need to heal because somebody shot my, my fucking leg out earlier and the wound just they? opened. Dead, dead ahead of me. Hello? Okay, I see if... okay. 
I was down. Are you down there? Yep. He's uh, having a bit of a seizure on my screen. <laughs> no, he's just lying there. <laughs> oh, the toss. That's what I need for my quest. For oh, so good that I chased him down here without what? any sort of valid, other valid yeah. reason. Oh, he's got a mustache as well. Look at that. Oh, nice. A map of the resort? That's Maybe incredibly taking... helpful to you as well, I imagine, you know. Oh, oh nice. Yes, I'm, I'm taking that. You will, that. you will probably print it out and study it at night, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't believe you. This extract's not open though, right? Yeah, no. Oh, oh shit, I'm stuck behind the door. Oh, Jesus. Okay, where... Oh, oh god, I'm blacking out again. Where are we going? Where's... My bullet just what ricocheted off of something. Built? I can't, I can't see anything. I'm like, are you behind me? No. What's going on? Hey, you're going, you're going the right way if you're going, okay. if you were planning to. Go this way. Yeah, I'm like blacking out. I, I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Wait, let me just drink an energy drink. I just saw my trace around bounce off of a scav. I'm not I'm not sure if I fucked that up or if I hit anything that wasn't rendering in between or something, but it was very infuriating. <laughs> so sure it was gonna hit him. Oh, there he is. There we go. He's down. Uh, by the way, uh, I, I observed your last PMC kill recently okay. uh, because I was editing yeah. that episode. And you know what you're doing. First of all, no, that's not my last PSC, my previous to last PMC kill. Okay, yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry, previous to last, um, the one on customs. Uh, so I can tell you what you're doing. First of all, you're sitting down. Second of all, you're not moving. It's going, barrup, barrup, and he's down. You know, easy. Not to not so to what, draw any parallels what, what between my recommended should... play style and. Uh, you say I shouldn't be moving. Is, is that what you're saying? Yeah, well, you should. Don't move while you shoot, unless it's like in a very chaotic CQ. Okay. okay. Not to tell you how I mean... to run your life or anything. Just saying. You will turn into a murder machine. You know, insert training montage of Fab uh, not moving while shooting. Don't we have like a fantastic, ah! <laughs> a fantastic uh, cyberpunk synthwave song for that? Uh, we we do, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, much uh, success. We should have brought a flare, but uh, apart from that, you know. Well, we'll run it back and do it do it again with a flare. We'll do it again. Oh shit! Run! <laughs> Are you okay? Uh, I'm okay. okay. I just extracted. All good. Oh. All good. All good.